Where is it? Where is it? It's gone. It's bloody gone. <laughs> but they took it, the assholes. <sighs> Whatever. What's the point anymore? What's the point in anything anymore? <sighs> hey. What do you want now? <laughs> here to laugh, here to gloat. Well, go on then, get it all over with. What was I doing? Well, I was going into town and well, I was about to grab my white cane, but it's not there. I can't feel any of it. I I know I left it in my bag because I never take it out. <laughs> How else would I know where it is? <laughs> it's got to be your so-called friends that took it. They took it out of my bag and they done something with it, put it in a place where I can't see it or find it. How do I know? <laughs> oh, uh, you're serious? Well, during first break, I left my bag on my desk like an idiot and, well, when I went out of the classroom, I noticed two of your friends lurking outside. Oh, how did I see them? <laughs> I have very good peripheral vision. <laughs> oh, rude. Being blind doesn't mean you see dark. <sighs> Sorry. I am... Legally blind, yes, but the real name is macular dystrophy. Macular dystrophy means there is fuzziness and cloudiness in your macula. You know, the, the center at the back of your eye. My eyes are like an elderly person. affects my center vision. Think of it like a gray spot that covers the front of your eyes, but your side vision is very much clear. Well, yeah, that's how it works. And my white cane is from the Blind Society. It tells you that I am visually impaired. That's how I get around. It's hard always looking sideways and trying to not smash into walls so you don't look like a fool. It's really hard. Hearing whispers about about you behind your back and feeling all sorry for me and being picked on by stealing your cane because it's funny, apparently. Or taking off my glasses because why do you have glasses? You are blind, right? You don't need them. It really sucks. Really sucks balls. All I want is to see like normal people. You know, I have to watch others come into college with their brand new cars while I walk or get a taxi or the bus. I should be driving at my age, but no, I'm a danger. You know what? I am not gonna bore you with my sad stories and 
I know people have it harder than me, but my feelings are justified, right? Like, it's just, well, you get what I'm saying. I just want people to stop feeling sorry for me and not see me as a blind kid and see me as a regular person. It's fine. I'll probably find it on the roof or something. Look, I might be over exaggerating, but can't I feel sad? about it all. No worries. It's nothing. I bet you're tired, right? I'll... I'll let you sleep. Have a good night, okay? Wait, what? <laughs> okay, I get it. You're joking, right? Ha <laughs> ha. This is one of your funny jokes. Yeah. You're serious. <laughs> I don't know what to say. If you can persuade them to give my cane back, I will actually take back everything I think about you as a person. If you can, then maybe, just maybe, I'll see you in a new light where you might actually be tolerable a little. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry for, you know, the rant. I just, have a lot on my chest, you know. Being diagnosed a few years ago, it it really sucks. There were plans, you know, getting my driver's license, seeing the world, seeing all new different places. But now that's limited. Yes, I can catch the train and the bus, but I have no idea what I'm doing. Do you? <laughs> well, yeah, I'm not a travel person, not like you. Oh, I know you are. I've seen all the photos that you have. You've traveled the world, haven't you? It's pretty cool. I wish I can do that. You know, with help the helping hand. This is nice. So, we can somehow become friends, get along, maybe actually enjoy each other's company. <laughs> Yeah. I, uh, I would really like that. I would really like that a lot. I, uh, don't really have a lot of friends here. You know, I don't really bring in the crowd. <laughs> oh, stop it. You would tell your friends to, uh, you know, back off a little bit, right? I know they're jerks, but you are kind of the ringleader. <laughs> well, I think you are. Hmm. Hmm. I see. <laughs> well. It would be appreciated. I would appreciate it if uh, you could tell them. 
and uh, I would like it if you would uh, be there to uh, to confront them and uh, and hopefully get my uh, cane back. I'm pretty sure it's on the roof. That's where everything always goes. <laughs> Seriously, I saw a PS5 up there. <laughs> uh, please, could you help me? I know you think it might be useless stuff to you, but it isn't to me. You understand? Uh, that is such a relief. You're not yanking my chain, are you? You are for real. Thank you. Thank you, I... Uh, I really appreciate it. Oh, um, sorry. Uh, sorry for uh, hugging you. No, no, it's cool. It's cool. Um... Yeah, I, uh... I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> I bet you're tired. Now, um, I'll... I'll have food in a minute. No, I can't. I mean... If you're really sure... I would love that. 